I don't know if it's a sign of my age or my West Texas background that I'm closely familiar with the phrase, if the Lord is willing and the creek don't rise. It's an old 50s country song that became famous after Johnny Cash covered it, and it's basically Texanese for, it will be possible if it is in God's will. But how do we know what the will of God is? And even if we already know what it is, are we ready to join it? To pray your will be done to God is potentially the most difficult prayer. We live in a time when social media and television constantly remind us that terrible things are happening every single second of every day, and there's nothing we can do to stop it. Praying your will be done is a reminder that God is at work in the world, even when we cannot see it. A prime example of this is Jesus himself. Jesus is the one teaching us these words in Matthew 6, and in Matthew 26, Jesus prays his own words. He says, Father, if it is possible, may this cup be taken from me, yet not as I will, but as you will. We know as readers of the story that God did not answer Jesus' prayer in the way Jesus wanted. Jesus was killed the next day, but God's will was done through the cross and resurrection. It came at great personal cost to Jesus to pray that God's will be done over his own desires of safety and protection. It's hard to imagine a place where God's will is fully and completely done because it does not look like anything around us on earth. We learn from the line, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven, what heaven is. It's the place where God's will is done fully and completely as God intends it. Meaning that the only difference between earth here and now and heaven is the completion of God's will. Our goal then as followers of Jesus is not to go to heaven. Our goal is for God's will to be done. As we learn from the story of Jesus, God's will is not always in line with what we want or what we think would be best. That's why this line in the Lord's Prayer is so difficult. In order to follow in the way of Jesus, we have to be a people ready to pray this prayer even when it is costly, uncomfortable, or challenging.